Hey folks, this new feature of ChatGPT Plus just came out. I saw this yesterday where we have talked about GPTs and what it can do, but before it was kind of linked to individual conversations, right? You have a conversation with one GPT, like you create, or maybe a friend or a fun of GPT you can talk to one GPT. And then if you want to go back and have a conversation just with ChatGPT, you have to kind of exit out of there, bring the information, copy paste it back into, G into ChatGPT. There was no seamlessness between from one GPT to another, or even from the ChatGPT conversation interface into your GPTs. Well, that has all changed. I'm going to show you how this looks and what this uh, how this works and how this looks like if in the uh, ChatGPT system. So let's do this here. Let's go ahead and I'm going to start here within ChatGPT. And let's say, assume the role of a grant writer for, let's say, the city of, and I was just in Sedona, Arizona recently at a conference. Let's say the city of Sedona, Arizona. So here we go. It's going to give us a little bit of information here. And I'm not really worried about what the information says. Right now, I just want to show you the capabilities of what this looks like. So it's going to talk right there. But look what I can do now. By hitting the at symbol, all of my recent and pinned GPTs come up. I can also go into here and create a GPT from right here. So let's grab the city grant writer I made. And let's ask it, what forms do I need for a CDBG grant application? for a new road project. I'm just gonna go through, give me some information. So look at this, now I'm talking to the city grant writer. I'm not talking to ChatGPT anymore. What is ChatGPT? We know what I'm saying, right? It's not the, it's not the GPT-4 model I'm talking to. I'm talking to my own trained ChatGPT, or my own trained GPT rather, right here in the conversation. Pretty remarkable what you can do here. Now watch this, what else we can do too. I can also say, let's say we wanna to talk to a different one. Let's say we wanna to talk to the other uh, grant one, take it for granted, and I can say, explain the steps of applying for a CDBG grant. And here, now we're talking to a wholly different GPT. Before I was talking to uh, the grant GPT I created on uh, the federal forms and whatnot, now I'm talking to the take it for granted, which is kind of a step-by-step -step guide to writing grants. So this is absolutely phenomenal that we can go back and forth in the conversation, talk to the different grants. And if I want to exit out of here and just go back to the regular GPT-4 model, I can do that and put the prompts in there. So pretty remarkable feature that they have here. Now, Let's go ahead and test this as well, too. Let's go back into our GPTs and let's grab a GPT that we have. So let's go to my GPTs. And what we're going to do here is we're going to open up this same one, take it for granted. Now, watch this. Let's do the same thing. Let's say, please explain how I can write a compelling grant narrative. So here we go, it's gonna understand the grant, plan the narrative, give me a step-by-step -step guide for the game. I'm not really worried about the content here, I'm just showing you a new capability that ChatGPT has. So in one of these videos, I'll read through it, this time I'm not gonna do it, you know, I'm gonna speed through it and show you this feature. Now watch this though. So I'm in the GPT, take it for granted. Watch what we can do. I can go here and I can go into, say this clarity bot and say, summarize the main points. And now I'm in ClarityBot and I can summarize the main points of what the GPT just said. I can even take this, do the same thing here too, and I can do GovAssist and say, give me an outline for presenting this to a city council. And there we go. Here is the outline. Look at this. I'm able to switch seamlessly from one GPT to another within the same conversation. So it looks like ChatGPT or OpenAI rather is beginning to roll this feature out. I'm very lucky I was able to see this ahead of time and, and do this video real quick for you guys. 
Let me know what you think. I'm also curious about this. For those of you who have ChatGPT Teams, does this work as well? This is a feature that works within Teams or those who have Enterprise. Let me know in the comments below what that looks like for you. But until next time, be well. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy the rest of your week and your day.